This is logic 2 with make bricks. In the problem it reads, we want to make a row bricks that is gold inches long. We have a number of small bricks, which are 1 inch each, and big bricks, which are 5 inches each. Return true if it is possible to make the goal by choosing from the given bricks. This is a little harder than it looks and can be done without any loops. So for our first example, this returns true because when you have one big brick and three small bricks, that is equal to 8 inches and that's exactly our goal. And on our second example, we have one big brick and three small bricks, which is equal to 8 inches, and that's less than our goal, so it returns false. And for our third one, it is true because when our goal is 10, and when we have two big bricks, two big bricks equals 10 inches, so that's exactly our goal, and it returns true. So to solve this problem, first we're going to have an integer called max big. I'm going to do a goal divided by 5. And this integer is pretty much going to tell us the maximum number of big blocks we can use to make our goal. So pretend, for example, if you use the first example, max big would be 8 divided by 5, and then coding in Java, that is 1. So max big would be 1. So that means only one big brick can fit in that goal. So what we're also going to do is we're going to make an if statement. We're going to say if the number of big bricks we have is bigger than our max, right? Then we're going to subtract goal with our max. Else, we're going to do a goal equals goal minus that means that the goal, big, the number of big bricks we have is smaller, so we're going to do that. Lastly, we're going to say if the number of small bricks we have is greater or equal to how much is left, and that's going to return true. Else, we're going to return false. Next big.